Hi, kindergarten. This is Miss V, and I wanted to start today with a story. Once upon a time, there was a girl named Allie Vervoort, and it was so beautiful outside, she decided that she wasn't going to sit down at all today, that day. And so she went on a really long run, and then she went on a hike with her friends, and as she was running down a mountain, her foot got trapped in a rock, and she fell. And let me tell you guys, that story is actually about me. So now, I can't walk. <laughs> Look at my ankle. Oh, can you guys see it? It's black and blue and horrible. I've never, um, I never hurt my ankle like that, but I did this time. I've never really hurt my ankle before. So now I'm icing it and I'm putting it up. So that means I can't dance with you today, friends. I'm sorry. I was really excited too, but I can still play music for you guys during Zoom. We're going to have a great day anyway. I'm going to have a great day. Um, we're going to see Sebastian's favorite toy. And let's start with our funny bunny money song. You guys ready? A penny's worth one, a nickel's worth five, a dime is worth ten, and a quarter's twenty-five. Hey, honey bunny. No, my money, money. Hey, honey bunny. No, my money, money. Awesome. Do it one more time with me. Here we go. A penny's worth one. A nickel's worth five. A dime is worth ten. And a quarter's twenty-five. Hey, honey bunny. No, my money, money. Hey, honey bunny. No, my money, money. Woo! Nice job. Okay, let's start our morning with our morning message. Okay, read along with me, friends. Don't let me do this alone. Hello, seed coats. Today is Wednesday, May 6, 2020. How amazing was Sebastian's basketball skills? I'm still just like, can't believe he's only six and he can do that. Today, we will be learning another long vowel that says its name. Today is going to be a great day. We love you. Love Miss Revort and Mrs. Florio. Hey friends, we never got to see how Mrs. Florio's baby Sonic came out. But it's really good. We'll have to ask to see it today during Zoom. Okay, and let's take a look at our sight words. Attention. Two. T O two. Red. R E D red. Let's do it in a different voice because it's fun. C. Lucy really likes this. Sag! S A I D Sag! Look at her over there. She likes that. <laughs> silver. S I L B E R. Silver. Can we do it like a robot? Three. T H R E A. Three. Seven. S E B E N. Seven. Hey. H A T put P U T put J S H A J up U P up yellow Y E L L O W yellow gray G R A Y gray Okay, pretend you're like dying. You're like a robot that's dying because it ran out of batteries. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Okay, come back to life. Oh, good job. Having an injury is making me a little loopy, you guys. Loopy means feel a little crazier than usual. I'm just like so happy I, you know, still have all my other body parts, okay. Okay, here we go. Special sound karate friends. There's a new one here and you're going to know what it says. What is that? I, I see a sneaky E. That means that bad boy gets crossed out. Mm, mm, mm. And this is where we put our consonant like an N or a P. Okay, so let's do it. I can't do my special karate moves. So you guys have to go extra hard. Okay, here we go. I, 
I consonant E. I. O. O consonant E. O. Sh. Oh. S. H. A. A consonant E. A. T. H. C. H. Did I get it? No? Good job. You guys did it. We're flying through our morning. Okay, hey friends, let's go back and look at our blah, 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 blah. Gorgeous new poem. Okay, how fast can you get these? Did we do capitals? And yes, we did capitals and periods yesterday. That means stay sight words. So that means there's gonna be a lot. There's always a lot of sight words in big poems because sight words are high frequency words. That means that we use them all the time. I got my purple out. Do you have your purple? If you don't have a purple marker at home, it's okay. Just circle it with a pencil, do what you can. Okay, we're all make, doing our best, right? Okay, on your mark, try and beat me. I'm gonna go as fast as I can. Can you beat me? On your mark? Get set. Go. I think it ends one, right, friends? How fast can you go? I can go so fast. You better believe me, or I just know it because I'm an adult and I'm faster than you guys. Ah, my hand's starting to cramp up. No, don't beat me, Mickey. Don't beat me, Aileen. I'm done. Did he beat me? Okay, let's go through. How many do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. <gasps> My favorite number is a sign. It's a sign. 22, that is my favorite number. There are 22 sight words in that poem. Let's clear my board, clear all my drawings. Good job, friends. And let's move on to, I'm gonna stop my share just to make sure that I get this because last time it did not work. So I really wanna make sure that we can see, read ebook. Okay. Here's my Zoom meeting, let's share screen. Hey everyone, we're looking at our long I words today. Okay, and here we are. I have a book that is I consonant E, and already you can spy some pictures here that start with I consonant or have I consonant E in them. Okay, this one right here is ice, say ice. This right here is bike, bike. This is Five. Do you hear I saying its name? And kite, kite. Okay, let's read these words. Ice, ice. Bike, bike. Five, five. Say it with me. Kite, kite. Oh, now we're gonna read, I see two. Um, you know what kind of words are those? Sight words, okay? This is ice. This is a bike. This is a five. This is a kite. And guess what? That's the end of our book today, but I wanna show you guys what you guys are doing for your work today. You have done this before i to make sure that my share is still working. So let's pull this up. Okay. Oh, I grabbed the wrong one. No, that's not what you guys are doing. Give me one second, friends. And I'm gonna stop my share and find that paper that I got before. That's not it. Oh, here we go. That's what happened, friends. 
by accident pulled the wrong one over and I think this is the right one. We're good now. Let me get my hair going again. My mom's throwing some pots and pans around in there. It's okay. Okay, and here we go. Okay, so yesterday you guys did, or two days ago, three days ago, you guys did a great job making word families with, I think it was ache and ain. Now the challenge today is, can you make some word families with ein and eyed? What consonants or blends can you guys put in front of those? So for example, I'm thinking of a great digraph that I know will go so well with ein. Can you guess what digraph it is? I'm gonna write it right here. Shh. Ein, shine. I'm already giving you one word, friend. Now listen, I want you to write mostly um, real words, right? But if you run out of real words and you're like, ah, I'm just gonna make some nonsense words, make sure that you write them over here and you read them to yourself, okay? So that's what you guys are doing today for your work. And I will see you guys during Zoom time. Love you. I hope that my book gets better soon so I could dance with you guys. I'm kind of bummed, but that's life, right? All right. Love you guys. Bye.